When was the last time you heard about a Falcon Heavy launch? Recently? Well, there's another one lined up and this one promises to be unlike any other. Just wait and see. The Falcon Heavy, just like the Starship, is a giant in the space arena. Other rockets like the Falcon 9 that dive deep into space at least 50 times in a year don't get as much attention as the Falcon Heavy because of many reasons. One of these is that Falcon Heavy is a rocket to reckon with in the space and rockets industry. Why is that? The power, the style, and the name of the company behind it tells the whole story. Falcon Heavy is a product of the space company SpaceX, proudly led by Elon Musk himself. Now, Elon Musk isn't any other name you hear every day. As of now, he's the second richest man in the world according to the Bloomberg Billionaire Index. But that's not news as much as how this tech enthusiast has completely revolutionized every industry he gets his hands on. The rocket industry is a good example, and the Falcon Heavy is just but one of his ingenious products. Falcon Heavy has earned the title of the most powerful rocket for about three years in a row now. According to SpaceX, the Falcon Heavy is capable of a whopping 5 million pounds of thrust, a value only equivalent to 18,747 jumbo jets. Given the admirable thrust of this powerful rocket, it's earned a name for the spectacular show it stages when coming back to Earth. Only recently, NASA's space launching system stole its first place title. Well, the SLS is not as good at pulling a spectacular show as the Falcon Heavy. However, SLS has managed to give a more powerful thrust than FH with SLS standing at 8 million pounds of thrust. We must say that the SLS has come a long way. You see, about a decade ago, when the present day Starship and Falcon Heavy were a mere concept, SLS was already there. In a few years of making the Falcon Heavy, the rocket came from its manufacturers and took the lead in the most powerful rockets list. This apparently impressive ability of the Falcon Heavy made NASA a frequent visitor and an unrelenting partner to SpaceX for the sake of some delicate missions. Up to now, we hope you were not thinking that the Falcon Heavy has gone for over 100 trips to space because this is not the case. The Falcon Heavy has only managed 5 launches since it was made. Nevertheless, this small number should not deceive you as the rocket's one-time trip can be compared to even 10 trips of another smaller rocket in a literal sense. This is because the Falcon Heavy is just a combination of three Falcon 9 rockets, and it can do exploits. It is the rocket in SpaceX's history to take the Tesla Roadster on a ride to space. The sports car is still making many oblong trips around the sun in the barren vacuum. Yet SpaceX has laid out an interesting plan to make 2023 memorable for its Falcon Heavy. The space company mentioned planning five launches for the Falcon Heavy rocket just this year. The seemingly ambitious plan seems to be rolling out just perfectly since the first launch of the Falcon Heavy was a success. A deep dive into what happened in the first Falcon Heavy flight is enough to tell you that the next and consecutive launches will be something to remember. The first launch of the Falcon Heavy since the beginning of the year was tied to one mission, carrying the U.S. Space Force USSF-67 mission to geostationary Earth orbit. This was the second national security space launch mission of the Falcon Heavy. Something unique about this first launch is the fact that it's going to reuse the same side boosters from the USSF-44 mission. Remember USSF-44? It's the mission whose minute details remain scanty at best. Something about carrying tools for the U.S. Department of Defense was muttered, but the rest of the details remained hush-hush to this day. Well, for the USS F-67 mission, things were a bit clearer and even more exciting. On the set launch day for the USS F-67, the weather wasn't favorable, with winds raging over 20 miles per hour across the Kennedy Space Center launch. The mission had to be pushed one day ahead. Yet even with the one day late mission, the launch was still as interesting. When the skies were clear, the Falcon Heavy engine lit in marvelous orange flames giving out the much expected 5.1 million pounds of thrust that sent it across the Space Center. The cheers of the excited SpaceX employees together with their families drowned as the rumble of Falcon Heavy's engines roared making a show of its power across the sky. Six hours after the spectacular lift from the Space Systems Command confirmed that the mission was a success. We had another fantastic launch today on a Falcon Heavy, he said. While there will still be threats to the Department of Defense and National Security Space launch, Falcon Heavy will still be viable for more visits into space. 
A projection of the same shows that SpaceX will be awarded more contracts from the NSSL between 2024 and 2027. While this is happening, SpaceX is pushing the record for most crewed flights. SpaceX exists for the sole reason of making a neighborhood on Mars. For this mission to ever be successful, the space company wants to start early by sending more crews to space. From the records, the highest human gathering in space is 13 people. However, this doesn't look like much to a space company that is in the business of recreating a new civilization on another planet. Elon Musk is projecting that a better Falcon Heavy will be up for the work of taking more than 13 humans, probably 50 humans to the moon, Mars, and later into deep space. As for the Falcon Heavy, it will play a big role in the Mars mission since it is the second highest payload capacity operational launch vehicle after SpaceX Starship. The Falcon Heavy was designed to carry 117,000 pounds to orbit. This is almost twice as much as its competitor, yet it does it for one third of the cost. Well, it's also part of the grander plan of carrying humans and cargo to Mars once everything is set. In 2023, the Falcon Heavy will be expected to not only fly four missions, but to also launch the world's first private lunar mission dubbed Dear Moon. The project will be fully funded by the Japanese tycoon Yusaka Mezawa. A total of six to eight other civilians will be on board for this mission planned to inspire creativity. This mission puts SpaceX at a massive valuation of $127 billion, so if you're thinking of investing in SpaceX, this could just be the right time. What are your thoughts about the Falcon Heavy that is about to launch? Is it something that you would live to see live on your television? Feel free to share your views in the comments section below. To this end, thank you for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe to our channel so that you can always get a notification when we post the latest and most exciting space news that you would not want to miss. Till next time, cheers.